Welcome to PowerScat's product portfolio. This orientation will offer an insight into EPC ProMan's module ISOMEC, including AutoSpec and EPM, that is Engineering Piping Material. Let's get right into it. PowerScat Private Limited has designed EPC ProMan's module ISOMEC to focus on catalogs, specs, calculation, while data sheet, preparation of piping isometrics based on specs, and rule-based with MTO BOM details. All modules of EPC ProMan software are offered as integrated solution or as individual module. One can also purchase and use individual modules like ISOMEC without buying complete EPC ProMan. As shown by the diagram below, a strict workflow has been established incorporating the use of the software's ICGP, AutoSpec, MTOMAN, and ISOMEC, all of which we will be looking at today. We will also observe the relationship between these softwares and AutoSpool. ISOMEC includes piping material management. Let's look at a few of their highlights. Piping material specification, quick isometric drawing routing, catalog ASME B16.9, B16.11, etc. Calculation as per B31.3 piping or B31.4 pipeline. Pipe wall thickness must be suitable for internal pressure as per the standard ASME B31.3, ASME B31.1, ASME B31.4 for Indian Boiler Regulation, that is IBR. Pipe wall thickness must be suitable for vacuum as per standard ASME BPVC Section 8 for pipe-to-pipe -pipe branch connection as per the standard ASME B31.3. Item code generation as per the catalog item piping material specification, PMS. Valve material sheet, VMS, initial or estimated MTO. Generation of piping isometric from outline of ISO's interface. Isomec catalog data. Bolt, coupling, elbow, flange, gasket, support, nipple, swash, pipe, reducer, plug, outlet, valve screw socket weld, valve flange, T, misc, reston, and cap. Let's look at the ISOMEC graphical user interface provided for spec creation. ISOMEC thickness calculations. The first one is internal pressure. Pipe wall thickness must be suitable for internal pressure as per the standard ASME B31.3, 31.1 and 31.4 as discussed before. Number two, IBR. Pipe wall thickness must be suitable for Indian boiler regulation. Number three, external pressure. Pipe wall thickness must also be suitable for vacuum as per the standard ASME BPVC section eight. And lastly, the branch repad. Pipe wall thickness verification of pipe to pipe branch connection as per the standard ASME B31.3. Let's also look at the ISOMEC graphical user interface for thickness calculations. We have the pipe wall thickness calculation, the vacuum calculation, the IBR calculation, branch repad calculation, temperature pressure table, factor A table, and factor B table. Isomet thickness calculation output report one. You can take a look at the internal pressure and the external pressure. Isomet thickness calculation output report two. There is the reinforcement pad and the IBR calculation. ISOMEC, the graphical user interface for VAL data sheet. Please take a look at the VMS template creation and the VMS report creation. ISOMEC, VAL data sheet with some output reports. Take a look at the gate valve and the globe valve. ISOMEC piping material specification output reports. We offer the cover sheet, the data sheet, and the branch sheet. 
ISOMEC does include PMM, piping material management. We offer quick isometric draw drawing and routing, rule-based and automated, with the maximum automation for improving your productivity. Piping isometric drawings with bills of materials and also various calculation features will, which will be covered in depth. ISOMEC, the key benefits. Server-based, easy-to-use, quick routing, time-saving, rule-based, easy mouse operation, standardization, quality output, and it also improves productivity. ISOMEC, the predefined and customizable settings. Auto annotation assignment, predefined dimension patterns, template ma mapping, layers setting to apply fonts, for instance, line color, line type line, and weight. Lastly, we also have the symbol designer for graphical representation. ISOMEC, routing functionality and features, specification driven and rule based, 2D or 3D rolling or skew, follow slope, messages, notes, tags, assembly, installation and tracing. Supports or attachments, spec break, cloud, and lastly, the shade break. ISOMEC, the graphical user interface for routing. Please take a look at the diagram below. ISOMEC, the drawing output. ISOMEC, the reports output. As discussed before, we will be focusing on bulk wise MTO and line-wise MTO. MTO man highlights. Number one, the perfect accuracy level that can be provided. Number two, time saving in operations. Number three, easy to adapt and user friendly. Number four, control on project grip and project material. And number five, precise data for planning and easy retrieval of construction data answered and reports. MTO man, let's look at the graphical user interface for spec. MTO man, the graphical user interface for root. MTO man, the output reports, the joint BOQ, material BOQ, spool BOQ, drawing BOQ, and the support BOQ. That brings us to a conclusion for this orientation. Please make sure to visit our website www.parascat.com for more details. Thank you.